This is Fox 6 News. Do not underestimate this storm. Sandy is here. We've moved to higher ground as roads here are turning into rivers. Millions warned about a massive superstorm. There will be people who die and are killed. And there will be big waves on Lake Michigan. Fences are set up to guard against waves and blowing sand. People are stranded at Mitchell. Their flight's been canceled to the East Coast. And sadly, Sandy is sticking around. Good evening. No time to rest tonight. Not in Pleasant Prairie. Sandy is making an impact right here in Wisconsin. Yeah, that Kenosha County Village has homes right along the lake. Tonight, they're sandbagging, sending out a voluntary evacuation order, and getting ready to open an emergency operations center. It is that serious. Our Jeremy Ross is there live right now checking things out, Jeremy. <laughs> Workers have gathered in this area around 6 o'clock this evening. What they have been doing over and over again taking place right behind me. You're seeing that they're shoveling sand, putting them into bags, and then, of course, wrapping those bags up. We have been told by people on the scene here that they have assembled more than 300 sandbags at this time. What they're doing, as soon as they're done, they're putting them on pallets not too far away. Once those pallets have been completed, they've been taken to an area not far away from where the dump truck is not too far away from uh, the area that we're standing in. Residents have been coming over, picking up those bags 25 at a time to put near their doors and windows. Their major concern going forward is the potential that high wind gusts will kick up and then make waves in this area anywhere between 14 to 18 feet tall. The major concern here for Pleasant Prairie, or the village rather, is warning residents of the potential for property damage going forward. We have seen several homeowners come in this area, estimated more than two dozen, picking up the sandbags, going in the area behind us, and getting those things all together to make sure that their homes are safe. A voluntary evacuation has been issued. We haven't seen a lot of fear or concern about their own safety, but really property damage is the major issue going forward. We are live in Pleasant Prairie. Jeremy Ross, Fox 6 News. Well, it sounds like they'll have tonight to prepare, and the worst of it is, is to come tomorrow and in the ensuing hours after that, so we'll see what happens. Jeremy, thank you very much. No doubt the lake really is the biggest danger. As yeah. Jeremy just said, they are expecting monster waves. Yeah, we're talking waves over 30 feet in some places south of here. And the wind to match. Our Henry Rossoff live along the lake with a grim warning from law enforcement tonight. Henry? 